Only some breaking news, massive news. The craziest man in professional wrestling, one of the craziest people in the world, uh, 77, Vincent Kennedy McMahon, has retired from WWE. Um, yeah, I, I was shocked as you were. I thought he would uh, hold on forever. Um, see, obviously, all the court cases and all that uh, started to come into place. Uh, a lot of a lot of issues have started to arise. So, I mean, it, it feels like maybe it's due time, but it's still a surreal thing to think that Vince is gone. He's no longer in creative. He's no longer CEO. I mean, he stepped out of CEO a couple of weeks back, but now he's officially retired. He's not going to be involved in creative or anything like that. Triple H is back. So, yeah, I would love it if Triple H took over creative. We had more like the original NXT, gold, like black and gold NXT, but main roster. I would love that. That's what I want, fingers crossed. Probably not going to happen, but there you go. So, yeah, Vince McMahon is retired. He tweeted out a couple about three, four hours ago at 77. Time for me to retire. Thank you, WWE Universe. Then, now, forever, together. Hashtag WWE. Hashtag thankful. So, that was Vince. And then, Ryan Saturn uh, put the entire... I mean, on the WWE's website, it should have the his his uh, statement, but I couldn't find it for some reason. It wasn't on the front page. Um, Stephanie's going to be on SmackDown tonight to talk about this, so I'll probably have my full reaction to that tomorrow morning. Uh, but before, but we have got a statement from Vince, from Ryan Saturn. So if this is incorrect, blame Ryan Saturn. <laughs> um, I'm just reading it off his Twitter. So it's uh, from Stanford, July 22nd, 2022. Vince McMahon today re- released this following statement. As I approach 77... So this is Vince. As I approach... Okay. As I approach 77 years old, I feel it's time for me for me to retire as CEO uh, of WWE. Throughout the years, it's been a privilege to help WWE bring you joy, inspire you, uh, you thrill you, surprise you, and always entertain you. I would like to thank my family... Uh, for the mighty con- con- contribution to my su- to our success, and I would l- also like to thank all of the past and present superstars and employees for their dedication and passion for our brand. Most importantly, I would like to thank the fans for allowing us into your homes every week and bringing you cho- the choice of entertainment. Uh, I hold the deepest appreciation and admiration for our generation of fans. All of our world fans all over the world who are have liked cur- curry like and sometimes even love our form of sports entertainment. Uh, sorry about the reading. I'm, I'm, I'm dyslexic, so I do struggle with reading stuff out. So that's Vince's statement. Um, surreal, very surreal. It's a very surreal moment seeing Vince go. Um, I'm hoping that the writing's gonna improve. I mean, does that mean? I mean, he's only just retired, and I shouldn't really be saying good stuff like that, but uh, I mean, you always hear all these stories about Vince McMahon tearing up the scripts like 10 minutes before the show and then completely changing it, and then the show's being incoherent and making no sense, and like random st- like random rules will be added and taken away and all this stuff. You know, Vince-isms. <laughs> and he'll push certain guys, which no one understands why he would push them over certain ones, but I don't know. Maybe we might get... I said, I'm hoping the creative's going to start going a bit more like black and gold NXT. Uh, that's what I want. I'm hoping so. I mean, I love black and gold NXT, hence why I'm wearing a Disputed Era shirt, even though they've not been a thing for about two years now. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm going to miss Vince, I guess. I mean, as a character, as a person, he, I mean, he's, he's done some dodgy things in the past from what I've heard. I've never met the guy, so, you know... I'm only, only judging of what I've, I've heard, but you know, I've had a lot of negatives, but also he has made WWE what it is today uh, by by uh, taking over all the territories and making WWE a super a global brand. It has made WWE what it is today. So, you know, without Vince, we wouldn't have stuff like WrestleMania or just wrestling as a, a, the, maybe the wrestling at the scale it is now would never be a thing. It would probably all be smaller territories. I don't know. Um, it's weird to think uh, Vince is going to be gone. He's been there since I started watching wrestling, and since pretty much everyone started watching wrestling, he's been there a long time. And he's seventy-seven. He's going to retire. 
I uh, hope he has a good retirement. He's going to have more money than God to play with. He can do whatever he wants in his retirement. Play some golf, hang around with his grandkids. I don't know. He, he can do whatever he likes. Um, probably, uh, probably have a great retirement. But uh, that being said, uh, yeah, he's gone. Obviously, all the allegations have probably got to him a bit and got to the WWE. And he feels like maybe he has to go. I feel like his hand's being forced a little bit, but probably for the best, I think. Honestly, um, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. It's going to be interesting to see what happens on SmackDown. Like as I said, Stephanie's announced she's going to be on SmackDown, uh, kicking off the show. So we're going to be interested to see what she has to say, um, and then we're going to be interested to see where we go from here. Obviously, uh, Stephanie is now part CEO with uh, with Khan. Uh, Triple H is back. We're gonna. It's going to be a complete shakeup of WWE. Um, honestly, WWE's been pretty boring. <laughs> the on-screen WWE has been pretty boring the last few weeks. Uh, off-screen WWE has been fascinating with this bit of bad stuff. But uh, hopefully, the scripted program is going to go in- improve now going forward. Because hopefully, they're going to have more people hands-on with it and uh, less micromanagement from Vince would be nice. Uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, I'm intrigued. To, I'm, it's just I'm really curious. It, no matter what, now the WWE is going to change, and uh, I'm curious to see what's going to happen here. Um, yeah, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. What's your favorite Vince moment? Are you sad to see him go? Are you excited to, for the future of WWE? Um, you know, I'm interested. I'm just really gonna, I'm curious to see where we what happens from here. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. And until next time, do sweet. Later, guys. You're fired.